Hey everybody, this is Stacking Cash. If you're new to the channel, I would like to welcome you and feel free to subscribe. If you're not new to the channel, welcome back. In this video, we're going to be having a look at where are the Bitcoin miners located in the United States of America. Take a guess right now and let's check. I'm Julia, we have state level insight on where all of America's Bitcoin miners are located. And what we see is that states like New York, Kentucky, Georgia and Texas are very popular destinations for this industry. According to Foundry USA, each state has its own appeal, but generally what we're talking about are places that are epicenters of renewable energy, a fact which has already begun to recast the narrative among skeptics that Bitcoin is bad for the environment. Mm -hmm. um, so Mackenzie, uh, first of all, I'm glad to see you. I was worried for a minute that you weren't looking like I expected, but uh, I was a bit surprised to see New York and Texas there at the top and not say Washington state. I know New York has got a significant amount of hydropower, but it seems like Washington has uh, even more. Do you have any sense of why um, the, the Bitcoin mining rankings might be different from where just data centers, you know, cloud data centers in general might choose to locate? Yeah, it's a great question. So one limitation is just the fact that the Foundry USA pool does not account for 100 percent of America's Bitcoin miners. Uh, so Texas, for example, ranks number four, but many industry experts believe that it's actually number one. And that's because some of the biggest publicly traded Bitcoin mining companies, such as Riot Blockchain, are not included in this data set. So this is really good for looking at, at larger trends around what's happening in terms of America's Bitcoin mining adoption. So you mentioned New York, and yes, that is a hydropower mecca. It's, and it's also a perfect example of how it, it doesn't matter that lawmakers aren't too keen on crypto miners. Uh, just so long as you have cheap energy that you can buy at scale, people want to be there. Miners want to be there. So, so that is one key thing for New York. It's also a big part. Uh, nuclear power also accounts for a big part of their um, electric mix. Their energy mix. Mackenzie, as you see these states fight fight between e themselves, I have to wonder what this all means about how much Bitcoin mining will move from overseas to here in the U.S. Right. And, and so we saw earlier this spring that China kicked out half of its Bitcoin miners, and many of them have been showing up in the U.S. And Texas is considered to be this new mining mecca. You have a lot of Chinese miners that have been directly transferring their operations there. And, you know, it, it makes sense. You've got uh, in West, you've got a cheap energy grid uh, that allows miners to just plug straight into it. And uh, and then you also have natural gas, which is a huge uh, new power source. And we're seeing deals being signed between these oil and gas companies and Bitcoin miners. So a lot is happening there. And, and that's where a lot of industry experts believe these Chinese miners are ending up. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this content, I would once again recommend to subscribe to my channel for more future details about cryptocurrencies. Have a wonderful day.